Hey, how's it? And welcome to this new video on my channel. Uh, this video is all about the Core Green Room. It's actually the first time that I'm trying it. This board came all the way from Germany to Cape Town yesterday night. And yeah, unfortunately on the airplane, it took a beating on the nose, but duct tape will fix it for now. So don't worry about it too much. And I'll get it fixed after this as well. So yeah, first of all, we need to stick the board up and then I'm gonna tell you why I chose this board and why I wanted to try it. And yeah, let's do it. Styling on it, I've been doing waves, small waves, big waves, no matter what. And I gotta say, I really love this board because it's super responsive. But as you might see, it has a complete different outline. So it's shorter, it's 5.2 instead of 5.8. Uh, it has a super wide tail, uh, it doesn't have too much rock in the tail. So yeah, it's just more small to medium sized waves. It's perfect, it's super responsive. It's my first board that is really short and I like the feeling of a short board. Uh, but yeah, I ordered the green room for the really bigger days. And what I expect from it and what I want from it is that it just uh, holds up even more speed than the Badger. The sharper rail on the bottom turn, it's just a bit more stable whenever the waves get super big and super fast. Uh, I just want a board that goes rail to rail and I can lean all my power in it. And yeah, that's what I expect from the board. So today we have a pretty good forecast. It's not too big, but there's some, there's some swell out there. So a uh, good chance that we score some waves. And yeah, just happy to try this board finally. I wanted to try this for a long time now, but I never had the chance to do it. And yeah, now it's just here, set up ready. So let's give it a try. The wind has arrived and it looks like we're gonna have some conditions for a nice sunset session. There are some decent sets out there. So good chance that we can try the board and see how it works in the waves. So I'll let you guys know later.
testing this board over the past month and I gotta say it's definitely a good addition to the quiver uh, but it was a bit challenging because I came from the Badger that is like an all tail pad board so you have all the all the weight all the power on the tail pad as it's just super wide and you can just like lean into it and on this board in the first sessions I really got to focus on uh, the shift between front foot and, and back foot because if you go just back foot on this one, you'll just sink and lose all your speed. But if you manage to, to get, a good, get a good balance between front foot and back foot, um, this board gets really fast. So you might have two turns on the closeout, basically. And yeah, so in the bottom turn, it did what I wanted from it. So it was just more stable in the bottom turn. And as the board is just faster than the badger, uh, you needed to focus on the kai steering as well. So the kai needed to be quicker in the right position than on the badger. So yeah, just everything went faster on the on the green room. So I guess the badger will stay my everyday board for now, because I just really like that I can put all my all my power on the tail pad. And I can just like explode in the lip and just like throw a lot of spray even in small waves but this board is definitely a good addition and it will stay in my quiver for the bigger days where I need a faster board I definitely still need to figure out how to ride this board so can do it better in the future but I'm ready to to trade for it and yes that's my thoughts on the board and let me know in the comments what's your favorite setup what kind you use what what boards you use and let me know if you like this video, if you want to see more videos like this, I could do a special video on the Badger if you, if you want me to, or on new kites, or whatever new gear I get. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a like, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment, and then I'll see you guys in the next one. So quit chasing all the time.